Now you can this. We want to show you the paradigmite. This is the paradigmite. It looks just like uh, uh, it's just copper tubing that I use to make it. And I, I didn't uh, use lead solder or anything. I just used silver solder to braze it with. So that's the best thing to use instead of lead, as lead can be poisoning. So I'm just going to show you. That's it, the top end of it. That is where the, the actual alcohol is going to come out. It's going to flow back into there. And that's going to be the outlet for the alcohol. That's the outlet pipe there. That's the inlet pipe there. That's got a hole at the bottom. That's joined onto there and there just to uh, give it extra support. This is a reducer. It's a 5 centimeter reducer. I don't know if you can see that, but it's five centimeters. The copper tubing I use is 32 millimeters. You don't want to go any smaller than 25 millimeters or one inch. Otherwise, you'll get an incorrect reading and your hydrometer will float too high because the, the, the liquid can't uh, go past the hydrometer and will push it too high. Yeah, I just used two 90 degree elbows. Yeah, I've been joined it there. And it's been joined there and there. So it's two 90 degree elbows. 32 millimeter copper tubing there. That's a 50 by 32 millimeter reducer. That's going to be the inlet. That's a, a female fitting that will just go. Uh, fit straight onto my condenser that's a half inch uh, tubing just coming in that's where the liquid is going to come in or the, vi the, the liquid that's came, that, that comes from a condenser and it will go drop down just in that little cup there drop down go down this tube and eventually it will start pushing up push up up all the way until where it starts overflowing once it overflows, it will go into that little bucket there and it will drip, drip through as this got a little hole there or this 8mm pop and just drips through. So I'll just get a hydrometer and just show you as the hydrometer will right be in there, there's plenty of space to give you a uh, correct reading so the liquid comes in there goes down to the bottom there eventually it will push up this is slightly higher please know that this is slightly higher than this one so the liquid's got to overflow in this one and then it overflows in this little cup there just like that so it overflows from there in that little cup and it drains through that little hole there into the bottle thanks for watching Cheers.